Controversy is brewing in the craft beer scene. Just hours ago, the founder of Modern Times Beer announced he's stepping down as CEO amid allegations he mishandled sexual harassment claims made by employees. This comes as women across the industry take to social media to share their experiences with sexism, not just here in San Diego, but around the world. Tonight, News 8's Abby Alford takes a look at the culture in the craft beer scene in San Diego and the push to make it more inclusive. The owner of Second Chance says that she has worked hard to empower women in a male dominated industry, and she says it's about time that everyone commits to making it a safe place for women. What started with an Instagram story from East Coast brewer Brianne Allen asking what sexist comments have you experienced has rocked the beer industry. It needed to happen. This is a reckoning. Allen has received thousands of messages after this and then shared on her Instagram rat magnet about bad behavior against women that include misogyny, racism, sexism, sexual harassment and assault by men in breweries across the world, including San Diego. I was disgusted. I was appalled. Allen even shared Cody Thompson's post. He's the host of San Diego Beer Night podcast and created these T-shirts. Money raised from the sales would be used to fund Allen's legal fees if those facing accusations decide to pursue legal action against her. Let's start an anti-sexist, anti-racist, pro-equality beer club. He considered leaving the industry after reading the stories from women who stayed quiet for so long. As much as I don't want to support a community where this is the norm, I can't allow myself to walk away from supporting the women in this community. There have been solidarity posts from brewers, owners, and the trade association San Diego Brewers Guild were also shared. It's also something you know strangely comforting about not being alone. Virginia Morrison is the owner of San Diego's Second Chance Brewery in North Park and newly elected to the Brewers Association. She's also the co-chair of the Diversity, Equity and Inclusivity Committee. She also started a similar task force at the Guild where she's the current president. We wanted to say we're going to do something, action, right? You can't just talk. The former employment lawyer has pledged to explore hiring, retention, recruitment, education, and as well as reaching out to HR resources that are often absent in small businesses. Where, where can we direct victims to make a complaint or how can we help our breweries investigate? Supporters say it's about accountability and making breweries safe for women. To read the Modern Times CEO resignation statement in its entirety, go to our website at cbsa.com.